And now, Good evening, and everybody. Glad you've made the decision to be with us. Alongside Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessator. And we're glad to be bringing you action and welcoming you to the MGM Grand here on the Vegas Strip in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada for tonight's main event. Ten rounds, featherweight action. And now the time has come. All the talk, now comes the walk. Come back, kids, coming down to the ring, and you can tell with that zip in his step that he plans on this one being a spectacular evening for him. Introducing first, hailing out of Philadelphia. His adversary, fighting out of the right corner, Dinamita! All right, gentlemen, protect yourselves at all times. Let's touch him up. Hey, nice work, great technique, the combo lands. Kid's comeback's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Oh, things opened up, and he was able to place the right hand well. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Will you look at this? Look at this pace that these two are fighting at so early in the fight. Teddy, each man must have been determined to think they can get the other one out of here early. Yeah, I want to see who blinks first, though. That's what's interesting to me. Who changes? They can't both keep this up. He missed with that headshot. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice. Oh, keep your feet moving. Comeback kids showing you a little defensive skill there. I better move away from that punch. Super two-punch combo by Comeback Kid. That worked out really well. Throw it off the... Let us see those comes. Comeback Kid's putting forth a great combination there. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Not able to land the headshot. Kid Comeback's doing well here with that two-punch combination. Back to the body. A nice block by Let's Comeback Kid. Here's a moment here as you see. That was a miss by the Comeback Kid. the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. Keep working the body. Solid right by Comeback Kid. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Good block there by the Comeback Kid.
better. Yes, it is. Especially when you have a guy in front of you putting the earmuffs on. You know, you cover up the way that his opponent is. He's supposed to put them together. One or two are going to be blocked. But when you put them together like that, they're going to get through. Nice combination. Jab, uppercut to the head. Final 60 seconds after two minutes of pure fury. A fierce right hand by Comeback Kid. Oh, he's hurt right there. He is hurt. You know, his opponent's doing a good job of just being patient now and looking. Okay, okay, relax, relax, take a deep breath. And let's show you Teddy's scorecard for the first three rounds. And another right hand comes in. Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counterpunch like opportunities like because he's got an ball. You know, he's winning the fight, but there's a risk there because he's starting to throw a lot of punches, sometimes a little carelessly. That's going to leave him a little bit open to a counter. Round number five has arrived. And he's holding... Oh, that's a big shot with the left hand. There's the head shot, but he parries it away. Head and body, head and body. Oh, that's a big shot with the left hand. There's the head shot, but he parries it away. One. Good work by Comeback Kid. Oh, he is stunned. He could go down. Keeping his hands up, getting rid of his opponent's offense. His opponent's cooperating with him a little bit because he's getting frustrated. He's looking for that big shot, and he's continuing to miss. He's making no adjustments. A guy's moving his head. You know what you want to do a little bit? What's that? Well, you want to feint him a little bit. Make him make a premature move. And then when he moves to either side, then you time him with a punch. Don't just go out there flailing away. Fires right back at him. Targeting that midsection. There it is! One shot and down, Teddy. And now he's going to have to find a way to clinch. He needs time to recover. One, two, three, four, five. I give him a lot. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Nice strike after catching one by Comeback Kid. He never knew it was coming. Look at how wide open he was for that hook. And just like that, look at that. Once again, he goes down. Can he survive this? He gets a Here we are getting ready for the second half of this fight as we've reached the sixth round. Protect yourself. Oh, a nice two-punch combo by Comeback Kid. Comeback. Oh, what a left hand. And bang, and away he goes. Can he beat the count? I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got that saying. Falling like a sack of potatoes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
hard to prepare for us, but many do. He's been down, now he's got to survive. So that's where you're wrong. It's not hard to prepare, it's a must to prepare. If you're a trainer, that's what you do in the gym. You teach a guy, if you're in this situation, this is what you do. You grab on. What a big shot. That was a big shot that caught him, and it's a big shot that may end him right here. That looked like the great pitcher, great Maddox. His sinker ball. Boy, it went down quick. And somehow, stay in this fight. Now he's got to avoid his opponent like the Black Plague. Oh, you're doing great. Keep moving. Keep doing A moving. crushing two-punch combo by the comeback kid. Oh! Can he beat the count? I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got that saying. Falling like a sack of potatoes. the fight Come. ladies and gentlemen by way of knockouts your winner That's what you want to see, a guy who can close the show and finish with style. He ends up a knockout victor tonight. And that's what his trainer wanted. His trainer was even telling him, step it up a little bit because he knew this was possible and they got it. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Have yourself a great night.